An expressed sequence tag or EST is a short subsequence of a cDNA sequence. They may be used to identify gene transcripts, and are instrumental in gene discovery and gene sequence determination. The identification of ESTs has proceeded rapidly, with approximately 74.2 million ESTs now available in public databases. An estate results from one short sequencing of a cloned cDNA. The seedness used for EST generation are typically individual clones from a cDNA library. The resulting sequence is a relatively low quality fragment whose length is limited by current technology to approximately 500 to 800 nucleotides. Because these clones consist of DNA that is complementary to mRNA, the ESTs represent portions of expressed genes. They may be represented in databases as either cDNA mRNA sequence or as the reverse complement of the mRNA, the template strand. ESTs can be mapped to specific chromosome locations using physical mapping techniques, such as radiation hybrid mapping, happy mapping, or fish. Alternatively, if the genome of the organism that originated the EST has been sequenced, one can align the EST sequence to that genome using a computer. The current understanding of the human set of genes includes the existence of thousands of genes based solely on EST evidence. In this respect, ESTs have become a tool to refine the predicted transcripts for those genes, which leads to the prediction of their protein products and ultimately their function. Moreover, the situation in which those ESTs are obtained gives information on the conditions in which the corresponding gene is acting. ESTs contain enough information to permit the design of precise probes for DNA microarrays that then can be used to determine the gene expression. Some authors use the term EST to describe genes for which little or no further information exists besides the tag. The significance of ESTs, their properties, methods to analyze EST dataset and their applications in various areas of biology have been reviewed by Nadir R. J. L. History, in 1979 teams at Harvard and Caltech extended the basic idea of making DNA copies of mRNAs in vitro to amplifying a library of such in bacterial plasmids. In 1982, the idea of selecting random or semi-random clones from such a cDNA library for sequencing was explored by Greg Sutcliffe and co-workers. In 1983, Putney et al. sequenced 178 clones from a rabbit muscle cDNA library. In 1991 Adams and co-workers coined the term EST and initiated more systematic sequencing as a project. Sources of data and annotations. Equals DBEST equals, DBEST is a division of GenBank established in 1992. As for GenBank, data in DBEST is directly submitted by laboratories worldwide and is not curated. Equals EST Contalks equals, because of the way estates are sequenced, many distinct expressed sequence tags are often partial sequences that correspond to the same mRNA of an organism. In an effort to reduce the number of expressed sequence tags for downstream gene discovery analyses, several groups assembled expressed sequence tags into EST contacts. Example of resources that provide EST contacts include, TIGR gene indices, Unigene, Stack constructing a state context is not trivial and may yield artifacts. When the complete genome sequence of an organism is available and transcripts are annotated, it is possible to bypass contig assembly and directly match transcripts with ESTs. This approach is used in the tissue info system and makes it easy to link annotations in the genomic database to tissue information provided by EST data. Equals tissue information equals High throughput analyses of ESTs often encounter similar data management challenges. A first challenge is that tissue provenance of EST libraries is described in plain English in DBEST. This makes it difficult to write programs that can unambiguously determine that two EST libraries were sequenced from the same tissue. Similarly, disease conditions for the tissue are not annotated in a computationally friendly manner. For instance, Cancer origin of a library is often mixed with the tissue name. With the notable exception of cancer, the disease condition is often not recorded in DBEST entries. The Tissue Info project was started in 2000 to help with these challenges. 
the project provides curated data to disambiguate tissue origin and disease state, offers a tissue ontology that links tissues and organs by as part of relationships and distributes open source software for linking transcript annotations from sequenced genomes to tissue expression profiles calculated with data in DBEST. See also, gene expression, complementary DNA, image cDNA clones, whole genome sequencing. References External links, EST's fact sheet from NCBI, a good and easy to read introduction to EST's. The NCBI Handbook, Part 3, Chapter 21 has a very nice overview. A class server for the classification of EST's from mixed EST pools using code on usage. The current number of EST sequences in the GenBank Division DBEST. Web resources for EST data and analysis. HTTP, ICB Med Cornelia Tissue Info slash Tissue Info Project, Curated Estate Tissue Provenance, Tissue Ontology, Open Source Software. HTTP, www.estinformatics.org slash. Web resource contains all publicly available ESTs which has been processed through various cleaning steps where contaminating DNA for example vector, E. coli and short sequences.